Man, look, I want to record so bad. I'm literally losing my mind wanting to record as bad as I do. I re uh, I record and then I re-record and then I put it down and then uh, I don't know. But you know what? It is embolic. It is return of the sun. Um look man, we all need a little bit of light in our lives and especially me right now. I, I'm I'm grasping for straws here, people, and not sure that I'm gonna pull the biggest one out. So um let me get on with my recording then. And I, I am writing again, not as much as I would like to, but um, hey, once a week, uh, maybe even once a month, it, 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 it's all good for me. Desires of the unknown. Escape to a peace. A peace in this place of absolute uncertainty. Why, why is it so wrong to feel everything I want to feel? The hopelessness sets in and it wishes to rot my core. Sometimes I wish not to feel anymore. To shut off the world around me. To be a outcast of absurdity. Well, it seems to be my way. Do you know how hard? Do you know how hard it is? To try and remain somewhat sane in this game of life. All those emotions while they kick in my fucking door. I feel the cold set in. Yet the warmth of a new day tells me to arise, to look on the positive side. I try to. I really do. Um, I think that is a thing that we really have no clue what the day will bring. But we do have a choice on what we let in and what we put out. In this life, we always want the things that only bring pain in the end. The funny thing is, um, we know this. And we still want it. Why? (sighs) People, why? Why is a question that I ask myself daily. As I said, I am... I am a lot to take in. Maybe I allow myself to feel the blow before it comes to be driven by a fear that keeps me locked here. To be rejected always seems to be a way of life for me. I want to understand the facts of life to get back to the old me. Not the one who used and abused, but the one who saw the light outside her window. Who looked for a space and I wanted to create. A little energy is... It seems... It's all I have left these days. A little of this and a little of that. All the ifs and cans, well... They feel like empty words lately. I think it's the winter months, this I know, as I look outside and pray for the buds to return to the trees, for the sunlight to warm my body. I grow gray and confused in these moments and endless hours of desolation and despair. I knew enough. I know. Damn it. Look, man. I know a new mindset is what I need to be able to see clearly. But somehow, my mind decides to tell my heart to freeze and to seize those thoughts. You people, you people just don't understand. These cold months, they take everything from me. So what am I to do? To lessen the pain in my eyesight, the ghosts that loom over my bed and keep my monsters fed, I become enraged. I want to break loose with nothing to, nothing to do but spat these words of hate. But you guys know me. I also wish to mediate a debate on the world outside. Why can't people see? What don't they understand? In order for us to be content, we have to lose in order to gain. Yes, I know. People always tell me I am slightly insane. All these memories and past versions of myself when I was young and carefree, when I felt as if I knew what tomorrow would bring, and I also believe that tomorrow would come again. I think it gets harder when faced day by day that you may not win the war in your head. That, what if your heart doesn't thaw? 
that you may never see those greener pastures again. Like I said, it is the in-between of winter and the coming of spring. Well, it gets me every time. So I bide my time waiting to see a sprout. And for the sun, maybe, maybe she'll be out. The sadness can't stay, and people, I will not let it win. So as I say again, blessed be, and please, try to remember to breathe again.